Welcome to another video tech tip brought to you by Digital Dimensions. My name is Maurice Cherian. I'm an application engineer here at Digital Dimensions. We're going to be talking about orienting views normal to a face and having a horizontal reference. In this case, I'm going to be showing you a, a drawing view that we wanted to get. In this case, I wanted to have the face there, that angled face, flat to the screen. But then we also wanted to have that top edge be horizontal there with the with that face still flat to the screen there so you could sometimes get some results by you know using the rotate view and you might be able to get something that works okay in this case I'm gonna go over to the to the model and in this case the part and I'm gonna go ahead and try to make that face front by using normal tool and you can see the orientation is not quite what I wanted I wanted to be horizontal there that top edge what I can use is I can use the alt left and right arrows and get you know to keep it flat to the screen but it's still not quite what I was looking for so I'm gonna go into tools options I'm gonna go into the system options I'm gonna go to the view selection and you can see there the the, the increment set to 15 degrees I could change that to 5 degrees and, and probably get the desired results but there's another way you can do it a quick way control select the front control select the top face and then use normal to and it will give you the proper orientation again that's going to be control select the face the second face is going to be the top reference and you can see what it did there and now the, the desired result again was to pick that face control select that face and the second face it would be the top orientation now that's the desired orientation so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to hit the space bar and you can see that view is flat to the screen there I use shift arrow to get the, the 90 degree orientation there so now I'm going to go ahead and save that by saying orientation new view here by hitting the space bar and I'm going to select in this case a unique name flat front here to to see the the view and now I'm going to go back to the drawing and now you'll see that those views are there and on this case you can look at the current view or the other orientation would have been that one where I it was the front flat view there so now I can bring that in from the palette or the other way I can do it is I can use the model view and model view lets you bring in the view multiple times with with you know many different orientations in this case you can see it did bring in the right one but you can see if it didn't I can always go down to more views in that dialog box and select that view that I saved so you can always go back and use that save view multiple times even if it doesn't show up in the palette using the model view alright that's gonna do it for today's tech tip thanks for joining us and to see more tech tips go to our website at ddicad.com thank you very much